The Honorable Minister of Health. Madam Speaker, I have the distinct honor of uh, taking part in a special Habitat for Humanity sod turning ceremony on May the 18th in the city of Winkler. Uh, Habitat first expressed interest in starting a new chapter back in October 2017, led by Christina and Dwayne Falk. A series of meetings ensued with community groups, city officials, and, a business, and the business community, uh, leading to both Morton and Winkler each announcing a home for local families. As we know, Habitat matches homes with qualifying families who purchase their home at market value, no down payment, and monthly payments based on their income. As they pay back their mortgage, the funds return to the chapter to be reinvested for new homes for new families. We all we all know the pride, security, and stability that comes from having a home that is really yours. This has been the legacy of Habitat for Humanities. Uh, members may not be aware that when Habitat first came to Canada in 1985, it was Winkler where the first Habitat home was built. And since those beginnings, uh, this global nonprofit group has grown to 56 chapters nationally, over 2,200 homes built in Canada. It is truly satisfying to see this initiative reestablished in the Morton Winkler constituency after many years. It's remarkable to see how fast this has all come together. The project would not be possible without community partners like Triple E, who generously stepped to the plate uh, by donating properties to Habitat. Madam Speaker, today we're joined in the gallery by two Habitat for Humanity staffers, Michelle Pereira and Vernell Myrosh from the Habitat for Humanity's Winnipeg office. Welcome to the legislature. Thank you for your wonderful work. And on behalf of all the members of this house, uh, thank you for all the ways in which you're making a difference. Thank you. 